There's a feature built within analytics called market movements, and it generally helps you assess some of the trends forming across the industry, such as most popular funds, least popular funds, etc. So to check out some of the reports you can create off the back of that, click on the report tab on the right, select market movements, and everything's operated here on the right hand side, so we can ignore the left. And you've only really got to do a couple of things here. So first of all, select a sector you want to um, report on. So click on maybe global. Performance period, you can choose up to a year. So let's report on a year. And these are the different types of reports you can generate. So let's try the first one, stocks most bought. Click on generate. And as the name of the report suggests, it then just shows you the most popular stock being bought with those global funds over the last year. And it ranks them in order from 1 to 20. Now, of course, you can do that in the reverse. Click on stocks most sold and click on generate. And that will show you the stocks that are most losing out from being selected as part of these funds. MasterCard at the top, Amazon, etc, etc. Probably the two most popular reports you can generate on market movements are funds most attracting money and shedding money. So this will explain to you on any particular sector, those funds that are essentially most popular in the industry right now. So let's just mix it up. Let's just change the sector to maybe a mixed investment sector. So I'm looking for a decent multi-asset fund. And as part of my research, I want to have a quick look at which funds are most attracting money over the last year. So again, click on generate. And the report provides you with a lead table of the most popular funds within that sector. And how it's working it out is based on fund size. What was the fund size of these funds last year? What is it now? then tries to calculate the impact of performance on that fund size and then what's left should be the inflows. So it's gauging it on inflows. If you look at all of the money sloshing around in the industry at the moment, where is that money going? And you can see nearly 3 billion has gone to Vanguard Life Strategy 60% and that's the most in that sector. So currently over the last year, that is the most popular fund and then ranked in order of inflow. And again in reverse, if you'd like to have a look at the funds most shedding money, just select the relevant report and click on generate. And much like the, the report beforehand, it flips it around and shows you at the bottom of the league table those funds most shedding money based on outflows. Now lastly, you've also got a report that shows you the funds with most top 10 changes. So again, if you click on generate, that will again give me a big league table of all of those funds within the sector and show me which ones of those are chopping and changing their funds on a fairly regular basis. And if you wanted to see the changes they're making, all you need to do is click on changes next to each fund, then it loads up a subsequent page to explain the difference in top 10 holdings over the reporting period. So I hope you found that tip useful. As ever, if you need to talk to our help desk, you've got live chat in the bottom right hand corner. You've got a contact us phone number with our help desk on the left. And you've also got a training team where you can schedule training and look at some of the many guides we've created already built into analytics.